We begin our high school report with a team looking to win a conference title in baseball. Eureka can get it done with a win at home today and the wind howling as the Hornets played host to Lexington. Base is loaded for the Mustangs, but Slater Wilcox gets out of the jam here with a strikeout. He was the winning pitcher. Eureka's Ben Jablonski had four hits. This is a single to center. Coming around to score from second is Drew Dingletine, who became the school's career steals record holder with a steal today. And Carson Gates with an RBI grounded to third. The Hornets are outright Heart of Illinois Conference champs with an 18-3 win over Lexington. Middle line line baseball leader Washington plays host to Dunlap tonight. And Gavin Lawrence having a great season on the mound for the Panthers. Seven innings of one run. Baseball tonight, here's one of his four strikeouts. In the second, Keegan Isbell with a ground ball to the left side. That's a hit scoring Tyler Humphrey from second. Isbell with a pair of hits in the game. And later, Jake Stewart with an infield grounder that's going to score Carter Prina from third. The Panthers win their fifth straight in the conference, a 3-1 decision over the Eagles. Middle line game at East Peoria where the Raiders play host to the Morton Potters and Kurt Sosnowski hitting for the Raiders. Going to right here, he's going to drop that one in. Gabe Ziegler Harris scores. Sosnowski went three for three. Same inning, Ethan Kredke with a single to right land, and Hidden comes across. The Raiders score 11 runs today. And Sosnowski with a complete game win for East Peoria. 12 strikeouts, Raiders 11, Morton 3. To softball, where Washington plays host to Morton, and Panthers pitcher Brooklyn Ogden is going to get the strikeout here with a nice low pitch and a nice little handshake with Malone McKinley. They've been doing that all year. Now McKin McKinley at the plate hammers that ball off the wall, nearly a homer. Instead, it's a double, but later in the inning, Ogden's going to help her cause with a bat. Scorching a line drive homer over the wall in center. Three-run blast. Panthers score 23 times in a win over Morton. In normal, Al Tolliver's current team, UHI, hosts his former team, Olympia. UHI pitcher Matty Adams with a great change up here for the strikeout. Olympia pitcher Danica Frazier not messing with the off-speed stuff. Just high heat for that strikeout. Good game for Ole. Lydia Rutledge is going to single to center here with two runners on. Runner at second stops at third, but Sarah Cross was at third. She'll score, and Olympia is a 10-3 winner over the Pioneers. It's crunch time in high school track. Normal Community's Allie Ince says she's ready. Conference meets this week. Sectional meets next week. State meet in two weeks. And Ince hopes it could be a record-setting state meet for her team. We have some great girls on this team, and so I think we'll really be like relay heavy at the end of the season and into postseason. So I think that'll be super exciting. And then also just continuing to focus on that 800. Um, would like to probably get the 800 state record at one of these years. Might happen this year. Could be another big state meet for Allie and Normal Community. And we've got much more with Allie and a story at our website, ciproud.com. Briefly, Pekin and Limestone are baseball winners. IVC, Tremont, and Brimfield softball winners. Normal West, soccer wins at home over Washington tonight.